The people of Pakistan are growing ever more used to scenes like this. This morning, yet another big city attack, this time Lahore. Gunmen attacked law enforcement buildings in the city, including the offices of the FIA, the Federal Investigation Agency. جی بہت بہت شکریہ اینی شاہد سے ہم گفتگو کر رہے تھے جن سے ہماری بات کروائی ہمارے نمائندے عاصم نصیر نے and it was a coordinated attack another target was the Manawan police training academy where three of the attackers are said to have blown themselves up اس وقت کے مناظر آپ براہ راست دیکھ سکتے ہیں اور کچھ لمحوں کے فوراً ہی بعد ایک اور نشانہ بنا دہشت گردی and in the northwestern town of Kahat a suicide bomber rammed his car into a police station آج کوہارٹ میں ہونے والے کار بم دھماکے میں جو خودکش پتال سے ہمارے ساتھ ہمارے نمائندے موجود ہیں ان کی جانب چلتے ہیں اور ان سے پوچھتے ہیں کہ اس وقت گنگا رام اسپتال میں کیا صورتحال ہے I'm a government school teacher. I was on my way to work. I don't know what happened. I felt like somebody hit me very powerfully and everywhere there was smoke. At that time, I ran towards a taxi. I don't know what happened. Everywhere, dead bodies were lying on the ground and people were screaming. I sat in the taxi and drove to the hospital to be with my husband. Dozens of people are thought to have died. There's been an upsurge in violence like this in Pakistan in recent weeks. Lahore is the center of Pakistan's cultural life and its most liberal major city. For a long time, it was spared the brunt of militant violence like this. But there have been a number of attacks in the city since the start of this year. Pakistan is planning a major military offensive in the lawless border region of South Waziristan, aimed at cracking down on militants. Although no groups yet claimed responsibility for it, the message from today's violence is clear. If that operation is launched, attacks like this will get a lot worse.